Hey guys, there's an update to the Yes Player, and the changes are there's D pad support, brightness safe, enlarged text, fixed buffering, which is a very big claim, right? Fixed bugs and crashes. There's a new modded version available in APK time. So if you don't have APK time, you can use FireDL or Downloader. Here's the FireDL code. And here's the URL for Downloader. If you need more detailed instructions on how to install it, I will link a video in the description and the end as well. So when you open Terrarium, you're going to get this new version found for Yes Player. But if you hit install, it's not going to install if you have the modded version. You need to uninstall it first. But there's also been some issues with people with the regular version that aren't able to install it. So for the people that are not using the modded version, you should uninstall it as well. And you can get Yes Player through Google Store or Amazon. If you want the modded version with no ads, you're going to get that in APK time. So for those of you who don't use the Yes Player and want to get rid of these pop-ups, which are quite annoying, I will show you how. So it won't let you cancel, so you need to hit your back button to get out of it. It will come back unless you go into settings. So let's go into settings. Okay, so if you're not using Yes Player, you need to choose another default player. The EXO Player is working. You can get MX Player Pro in APK time, or VLC you can search for in Amazon or Google Play. So I'll just show you with EXO Player. So you want to choose default EXO, then you want to scroll down. Right here where it says playback, choose default player. Always ask, it's going to ask you to use yes. So you want to choose player default. All right, so now when you back out and we'll exit Terrarium and come back, you won't see the pop up anymore. It's gone. So that's a way to get rid of those notifications. It will bring this up when you go to select something to watch, but all you have to do here is don't ask again and click more ads. So if you're using the modded terrarium, you don't have to worry about the ads. So you'll hit more ads. And now we'll back out again. And we'll go back in. Okay, so that gets rid of all your pop-ups if you're not using yes. So I wanted to cover that first. All right, so now for those of you who do want to use it, we're going to go get the modded version in APK time. We're going to go into settings and we're going to uninstall the player. So scroll over to settings, then scroll to applications, scroll down to manage, and then scroll down to yes player. Alphabetical should be at the bottom. Okay, so click on it. Now click uninstall and you have to click it again. Okay, so now it's gone. Now we can go grab it in APK time. So here's the thing with APK time. Right now it's in the category of latest if you find this video later on, it may be moved. So I'm going to show you where it would be moved to. So if you scroll down, so let's keep going down and I'll show you where. Here are players and browsers. If it's not in recent anymore, it will be moved to players and browsers for Yes Player. Okay, so it is here, the new version, so you can get it this way. But if you want to see what's new and updated, you can go into latest. 
if you download anything from here, it does not work on a Fire Stick. You need to see if it's in Fire Device Menu. Okay, so you can get your MX Player Pro. And what's very important in APK time is anything you're going to install, you must uninstall another version of what you have. So after you've uninstalled is when you come in here to get your downloads. Okay, so here's Terrarium, and this is for everything except the Fire Stick. So it's the new version 1.9, ad free, but you can also get the ad version with the link that says download ad version. Okay, so Yes Player is in here as well right now because it's newly added. So don't forget, if it is not in latest, it will be in Players and Browsers. So you can go ahead and hit download. and scroll over and hit install. Okay, so now you get app installed. So you don't need to open it, you can hit done. Then you can just hit your home screen and go into Terrarium. So one of the updates it's claiming is to fix buffering. So that's a pretty tall claim. <laughs> I'm not too sure about it. Um, I'll take a look at something real quick. So I tested two movies and two TV shows and I had no buffering on any of them and no ads on any of them. So it seems to be better. Um, my only complaint would be now is there seems to be less links available, but maybe they've weeded out the ones that were bad. So maybe you're only getting quality links showing up. Uh, you can always add Real Debrid if you want to get more links and they're better with buffering as well. It's pretty cheap. I was so happy that I got it. I didn't get it for a long time, but it comes out to like $4 a month or something like that. So it's really affordable way to have more options. So for me, I think it's worth it. I have a video on that. I can show you how to get it. Um, but let me show you where you would put it in here. You can also get All You See, which is free. That's also in my other video. Um, so that's where you would you put it in. So you'd put your All You See API key in here and log in to Real Debrid here. So then you just go over to your device and you enter in the code on the website and then we'll see how many more links we get with Real Debrit. Okay, so now I'm logged in. You can see status logged in on that. So let's go check a movie. Also, when you're choosing movies, choose a movie that's been out on DVD because that's how they get the rip. So if you're looking for new movies that aren't out on DVD, you're gonna find not a lot of links or you're going to find hard-coded copies that have writing that you can't get rid of. So you have to be kind of patient with movies if you want to get good links and we can't really complain when they're still in theaters that we have perfect qualities at home. So let's take a look at Dunkirk because that was pulling some good links in my last video. Okay, so these are saying 1080, but they're Debrid. The green ones are real Debrid, and they say DEB. And the white ones would be what Terrarium pulls without. So the Terrarium ones hardly have any that ever say 1080 anymore. So this is what people are complaining about. I mean, they are HD. Um, so for instance, this is a huge file size. I would not choose that one. You could get buffering due to your internet because it's so big. They're usually 5.1 surround sound. So you want to choose one around here. I would choose this one right here. This 2 gigabyte Rapid Gator. So again, I'm not getting buffering and I'm not getting ads. So right now it's great. 
except for the number of links, which you can fix with Real to Bread. For me, it's a small price to pay. It's one Starbucks a month to get a bunch of great links that hardly ever buffer. All right, guys, so at least you can enjoy what I found to be buffer free, which is what they claim in this update. So far, so good for me. I hope it works just as well for you. All right, guys, I will see you soon.